lineup. I can tell you that right now. To try and assist with your clears as well. Previous game, a huge amount of roamers here now, and Knock barreling down onto Grixer's location, but he's ready for it. Obviously, that drone at his feet, kind of a call sign that somebody's more than likely in the area and trying to pick up their initial kill and advantage as well. Shots in from Doc to try and stun out some of the resistance by Pillar. Is going to work out too as Asian strikes true for PB and gets the first kill going against Kansan. That trades us back down into a 4v4, but they're frozen past this point. No other access points to work their way in. Geo, though, going to be forced out forward. The down is claimed on him as he reacts too slowly. Blaz with a second pick off as well. The defense falling to shreds here. Finally, Rexon activates, though, with a double. Knocks out both of the players, putting hallway pressure onto this site. He's still got more to go and nearly loses himself there on the hallway swing, but at the moment, outwitting the aggression from Kool-Aid. It was going all well until it's Rex and everyone losing. Play with a heavy hand, but obviously he's outwitted and taken down. So we're going to see a little bit of an active defense put up by the Sonics now as they move up. I swear to God, I thought Gunner just did that. <laughs> I thought so I too for cried. a second. It wasn't. That was off camera, folks. Uh, it was Rexon over here by Big Tower. I'm assuming someone tried to take a challenge by the staircase. Or well, they're so fantastic for clearing out a lot of different portions of the map. Rexon is an absolute <laughs> god in this game so far. A triple kill for him on the round. He's been outside more than he's been in, and he's looking to get another one. Peek me. What are you doing, Aska? Sit down. Oh, my God. Goodness How many kills gracious. Did he <laughs> that is seven kills. Mixon, though, uh -oh. nearly cut off uh -oh. on the cross. He's Here we go. The truck the stingers. <laughs> <laughs> they take him down. Asian gets the finishing blow as well. That's the first time I've ever seen a player actually get down by track stingers. So props to Asian for that accolade in my casting book. But it's not over yet for PB. They've taken down Kansan as well. Much better mitigation of the extended game this time. Controlling Rex and, of course, Grix are potentially still going to be a problem in T2. But I think they have accounted for that in this clear. Asian, there we go. Not Knocking out another element of PB, or rather of the Sonics defense, by taking down Kansan. Well, minus drone, Sonics really haven't gotten too much. Grixer will finally take down Blaz, but with track stingers practically everywhere, it's going to be difficult for these defensive members to try and rotate minus Grixer's impacts that could be quite useful in a situation like this. Kool-Aid obviously won't have to deal with those track stingers as he is on the offense. And it's going to be a smoke push here for Grixer, but he's caught off guard. And uh, that's potential clear. So PB, a bit of an over... They have, uh, oh, I love that. That was so gorgeous from Parabellum. So what they're going to do is they're going to charge the EMP fully, and it's actually going to reach through the ground to grab those ADSs. They get rid of the ADSs there, so the shield's now bare, and they can get that, but obviously that was the end goal. Get a nade in there and try and nade out the player playing inside of Elbow, but either way, a heck of a setup for PB. Geo now going for a heck of a setup of his own. He's going to get stunned out here. Grixer down low, trying to balance back and forth between a multitude of different angles. Geo, oh my, some amazing shots back and forth, but it's mostly the other Mel's. We get back into it, it's taken off though, and there we go, the play is made. Oh, Geo though, with a double for himself, catching the case as there's an attempt to hop in through the window as well. Now Grixer able to activate. Eska will finally find a successful cutoff by moving in through the attic, but that's only one kill against three here. Sonic's absolutely taking the advantage from that fight, especially with the case now being down on the ground, and. Geo having the additional capability to bait out potentially Blaz in a moment here. Oh, what a shot from Blaz, though. But the damage is already done. It's two to three, and somebody has got to get this case down. There's no drones for, for him. Blaz is going to EMP things, but should he EMP'd over towards this actual laser gate instead to be able to assist himself? They can't even get the wall open. Might have been a distraction, but now Eska will obviously be known. The BP in trophy sees him through the attic single panel. He's been now apply, but it is going to be later on into the round. Still come into play in a big way. PB ready to contest against Ooh. things up here on the upstairs hold, and they will find the first kill. I don't believe it's going to be against the hold from that specific angle, though. It's against Gunner way downstairs. So all this talk about how the warden could potentially change things up, and he's unfortunately the first to die. Well, I won by Geo on the last Beautiful. hold there. Rexon, though, swinging out. Touching Blaz with his pants down. He's going to be able to eliminate him as he tries to get sneaky in towards the plant. Kool Aid still feels the confidence to move forward, though, and start the plant procedure in the back of stage. They'll indeed begin that. Here comes Geo on the big flag. They have no idea that he's here. He won't be able to stop the plant as he's too overwhelmed as he approaches the situation. Also gives an opponent time to back up and establish crossfire against him. So PB take control yet again. Rexon now left alone inside of a 1v3 here. Has the correct read on the top flank that's going to be deployed against him, but that player not feeling too adventurous at this point. They want to let the players on even terrain have a chance at this one before they need to peek out. 
out of there. They're not like, oh, we're going to wait 45 seconds just to see if the Sonics want to do anything around the site. And speaking of harsh, this setup is harsh for SQ to try and play into because a lot of these flashes are going to be counteracted by Asian. And not only that, uh, some harsh crosses abound. But fortunately enough for the Sonics, they've gotten through the thick of it. They've taken down Asian and Asuka, but finally, this defensive setup has teeth. Doc will take down Kanzen. Kool-Aid still with the smoke in his pocket, but Gunner's directly behind him. Two big kills out of PB. They take the man advantage, but they know Gunner is directly around here. The case not in their pocket. Gunner will finally pick it up. He'll start the plant, and now they have to go soul searching, but it's going to be super easy. Kool-Aid. <laughs> That is great news for Parabellum, though. Aggressive here, but just cannot find any luck. Thankfully, they haven't outright lost anyone, but both Asian and Doc now taking some hits. Blaz also going to fall outright. That's not either of the two players that were damaged. They're still dealing with that health deficit on top of the lost player now. Yeah, that was Rexon on the complete opposite end of the map. We watched Kanzen toss that grenade in, and it actually ended up getting caught up, I do believe, by an ADS. Grixel will take down one. G will take out another. Parabellum are trying to That's get a... it back in body count, but it's just not working out for them, John. It's a bold challenge for Asian there too at such low HP that he was at goes for the direct peek against the Geo continuing to read into these swings now as we're down to only one for the defense and hey it does get the planter oh. so we're not done with this just yet Doc now alone but at the same time he's alone with the case so this is potentially what rounds looking for the penultimate one here in round master he's more likely going to proceed through yep we've got a soft breach here on the closet what so nicely shot. played Asian thought he's going to be a little too quick to get caught there but instead it's the reverse Rex it to wrangle in a freaking kill here against Asian. Gifted to Sonics off of the back of his efforts. Take down Asian, and what a plant now looking for Gunner as he's worked his way into split. Grixer's taken down one. There's no way that they prevent this from going down. Not a single person will be able to stop them, and Rexon somehow found two more. It's down to Kool-Aid. He's slipped through the cracks, but, well, not really, has he? They've actually discovered him. Rexon will take, will be taken down, and it won't be the quad for him, but it'll more than likely be the... Shall we go from bad to worse? Go ahead. Well, after the first two rounds, we actually saw work. It's going to be a little bit more difficult, and when I say a little, oh, I mean a lot. No. Pans in the I don't even know where the angle was, but he finds the exact trade on to Asian, more than likely catching him in the classroom hallway here where Kansas is droning out right now. I feel a little uncomfortable for sure for the Sonic, so I wouldn't be surprised if one of them tries to dance past this in a second. But Sonic still have a trick up their sleeve as well, mainly in the form of Gunner with these Candelas. Utility inside of the site, there should be a decent amount of mitigation for this, just on the ADSs, of course, but at the same time, those Candelas can pop out before it can eat them, so I'll have to wait and see as they're out. They ring out, and indeed, the execute begins to come through. Oh, no. Blaz behind oh. the laundry machine. The second kill is fully blinded, also beautifully played by Blaz. Rexon needs to be a little... Up main stairs in a pretty considerable fashion. Blaz is dead to the world. Where's the help? There he is, finally. He'll get gunned down from Asian coming up main stairs. That's going to be the hard breach of Ace out the window, uh, but some pretty solid damage done to PB's setup, at least from the trophy perspective. Sonic's two for two on losing their hard breach on entry here, though, is going to potentially cause some problems. Oh, what a swing on the timing there from Kool-Aid, but Kanzen, he is able to catch it. He reads into the potential threat. More likely a good calm from his teammates there, too. A little slow on the reaction, of course, to the school hallway push, so he's not going to be able to immediately catch the trade on the next defender here, but still, it gives Sonic's the advantage. Asian does seem to want a little bit more to play into, though. He's going to try to proceed forward. Wants to take the challenge. They've heard him, of course, shooting out the drone. But can they find the right timing to kill him? Yes, Rexon can. And now it all falls to this. SQ 